Shortly after McBann was sentencing, Charlie Adelson made his in-person appearance in court this morning. Adelson, who's facing first-degree murder, conspiracy to commit murder, and solicitation to commit murder for his involvement in Markel's death, filed a motion for an Arthur hearing. What is that? Well, it's a type of hearing that, according to Don Pomfrey, who is a legal defense attorney in Tallahassee, that's a hearing that is used for pretrial release for defendants who don't qualify for initial bond. They'll have an evidentiary hearing in which Mr. Adelson's attorneys will uh, will challenge the state's evidence. The state will put on their evidence and uh, the defense can put on evidence. They typically do not. And typically the defendant does not testify. At the hearing, which according to Assistant State Attorney Georgia Kappelman, could take place in September, the judge will make the final decision at the end of that hearing on whether Charlie Adelson will be granted pretrial release. The state hopes the trial will begin at the beginning of next year.